I hereby want to inform the country we are now making changes in the Senate and that those changes will be, have, will be communicated to the Speaker today. That is, changes in the composition of the various Senate committees. Change number one will be SBC. SBC, we are going to replace Senator Langat with Senator Sakaja. Change number two will be Powers and Privileges Committee. We are going to replace Senator Kangata myself with Senator Cheral K. Devolution Committee, we shall replace Senator Kenua with Senator Murkomen. Education Committee, Senator Langat will be replaced by Senator Milgo. ICT Committee, we shall replace Senator Pogisio with Senator Kenua. Jaila Committee, we shall replace Senator uh, Cheral K with Senator Linturi. Also, uh, sorry, JLAC, we shall replace Senator Cheral K and Senator Linturi with Senator Kindiki and Senator Langat. And uh, CPAC, we shall replace Senator Linturi and uh, Senator Dulo. Delegated legislation, we shall replace Senator Pogisio with Senator Linturi. The effect of this will be that uh, Senator Kenua will cease being the chairman of the Devolution Committee. Senator Linturi will uh, cease from being a member of PAC and also a vice chair of LIGO. Dr. Langat will also cease from being the chairman of Education Committee. And also Senator Cheral K will cease from being the chairman of LIGO Committee. Awale ambao tumeweza kuleta mabadiriko hivi sasa yanatokana na mambo ambayo yanahusu chama. Chama kina haki ya kufanya mageuzi yoyote na hiyo ni haki ya chama ambayo kwa hivi sasa lazima iweze kuheshimiwa. Ya muhimu kabisa ambazo ambacho tutajaribu kuzingatia ni nidhamu. Kama chama kinachotawala hatuwezi kuwa kwamba tuko na wale ambao hawafuati maagizo ya chama. Kwa mfano katika bunge hatuwezi kuwa na mtu ambaye anakuwa mwenyekiti ya kamati muhimu na kwa upande nyingine anapinga msimamo ya chama ama msimamo ya wa rais wa nchi yetu. Kwa hivyo yale ambayo tunafuatilia kwa wakati huu ni kuhakikisha kwamba tuna nidhamu tuna party leader moja, tuna rais wa nchi moja na katika mkutano ambacho tutakuwa nao kesho na hata mkutano ambayo itakuwa ya parliamentary group ama mkutano wa NEC ya kwanza ambayo tutaweka mbele kipa mbele ni kwamba kila kila mwanachama awe ni nani awe ako na nidhamu kwa ajili bila nidhamu basi kama chama ambacho kinatawala hatuwezi kuendesha nchi yetu if we have a dysfunctional party we cannot have a functional government